Have you felt that? What do you attribute it to? Um, well, I mean, I, the continuity and flow amongst your five is <coughs> is really impressive. Well, we appreciate the compliments. So I we I talked a little bit about this kid that we met in over Christmas, Danny, um, in Delaware. We I, I talked about it so much is that. We could have gone to so many tournaments, but being able to have a life experience, I, I really think that situation brought our girls closer. Losing in two regionals back to back, of course, there was some steam there. We knew we had to overcome that hurdle first, but they've been resilient this year and they've been fighting through adversity. But what I really love about this group is that they're, they're so close and you can see them, the, the environment is loud and I can see girls saying, let's bring it in, and they're controlling that on the floor as much as I've ever seen before. Um, yeah, I just think that we really come together as a team. Um, the first half was, it was a little struggling. You know, we lost our uh, second game to this team out of Kentucky, so we just had to, like, come together as a team. We had team meetings. We just said, this is what we need to do. And we made our run, and then um, we had lost to Reynoldsburg. So it was like, we were at the top, and then we had to get you know, push back down to show us like we can be more than what we truly are. It like basically just brought us closer together. And um, like Coach said, the uh, trip to Delaware um, when we met Danny, it was just like it was just more than a game. It made us like realize that somebody's there's somebody that has it worse than us. And you know, the kids fighting for his life every day. And we just wanted to you know just dedicate our season to him and just tell him like this is for you. And it just made us, it just brought us closer, made us more of a family, just made us appreciate basketball a lot more.